Hi and welcome to another video by Jim the Car Guy. Today we're going to talk about how to reattach a mirror that has fallen off the window. As you can see we have that, that glue on the window so what we're going to do is going to come outside the window where the mirror was attached to before. We're going to take a marker or pencil whatever you have. We're going to mark the window where the mirror fell off. Next thing we're going to do now is we're going to go inside the vehicle. We're going to take the mirror. You cannot attach a mirror to a window. Um, you need to attach just the cleat portion of it. The, if you try to attach the entire mirror, it's not going to hold. It's going to wind up falling right off the window again because the, the glue needs to dry for at least 15 minutes. I always like to do for at least a half hour, an hour before I reattach the mirror. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to come in here with the screwdriver and we're going to pop this cleat out of the mirror itself. You just get in the back of it with a screwdriver and you give a little bit of slight downward pressure and it'll usually pops right out. All right. We're going to come up with a razor blade or some kind of a scraper and we're going to scrape off all of that glue that is on the mirror from where the where the mirror has fallen off. It's very important that you get all of that glue off of there because if you even leave just a tiny little piece of it, it's not going to sit smoothly and it's going to wind up falling right back off the window again. But as you can see, we now have our mark of where the mirror needs to go because we marked it on the outside with that marker or pencil or whatever you used. Okay, not only do you have to make sure the window is clean, you have to make sure that the cleat itself has no glue on it or any kind of a bump or anything like that. It needs to be perfectly cleaned. Okay, then what you do is you open up the kit that comes with it. Clean the location where the mirror is going to go. And you also clean the back of the cleat where it's going to reattach onto the window. You let it dry for a couple of minutes and then you take the adhesive, the glue, and you'll apply the glue onto the back of the cleat. I'll show you. Spread the glue over the entire back of the cleat where it's going to be attaching to the window. Make sure you cover the whole surface with the glue. Then you take the cleat and remembering your location on the window, you take your cleat with the glue and you attach it onto the window where it was and you had the location marked and you just hold it on there for a couple of minutes until it sets up. What I always do is hold it on for just a minute or two, let it set up and do not hang the mirror. You let the mirror, I mean let the glue on the cleat dry once it dries, usually it's about 15 minutes they recommend. I always like to leave it a little bit longer before I reattach the, uh, the mirror. Because if you try to hang the mirror right now, that's going to fall right off the window and you'll be doing it again. Alright, so just hold it on for about a minute. So uh, we'll let it dry and then we'll come right back to it. Okay, we're back now. We're going to reattach the uh, rear view mirror onto the car. We let about an hour go by for the, uh, the glue to dry on the cleat right here. And you're going to put the mirror back on. Just goes on like that. Slides right over the top of the cleat. Locks in position. That's it. We're going to tuck our wiring. I'm going to tuck the wiring back up underneath the headliner right here. Set your mirror. And that's it. You're all set. Make sure you let the glue dry. It's got to be at least 
half an hour. I always like to let it uh, dry for about an hour. All right, good luck. So as you can see, attaching the mirror is really not that difficult. The main thing is you have to make sure that everything is perfectly clean before you try to put the glue back on or even clean it off. All right, as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.